Yes, my dudes, it is hot AF. Let me give you some piece of advice. Don't take allergy medicine at night when you're editing a video because then you'll fall asleep and then you won't release it at 10 in the morning like you planned. It'll be released at 3 p.m. And that's okay because it's it's out now it's out. <laughs> Let's go ahead and tour this real quick. Okay, is everything dying? I think so. A little bit. Still got moss. I might have to get some moss out. Yep. We're getting there. Let it die off, but as you can see, the edges are fire. Super fire. And then we have ours which we just seeded for fun yesterday. Was it needed? No. We definitely don't need a seed yet, just for fun. There is something wrong with the sprinkler system because it's not turning off. This has been watering for ever. The valve might be stuck open. That's freaking weird. So now this is just completely soaked. <laughs> Jesus Christ. See, I was out doing stuff and I remotely turned it on. This has been on for an hour. Easy, it's been on for an hour. Does it need it? No, it definitely doesn't need it because it's been raining every single fucking day. That frustrates me. Beehive's killing me. We have this right here. Looking not too bad. I'm gonna mow this today. I don't like that that didn't turn off. Looks like I will not be remotely turning on the sprinkler. Can it use it? Sure, it can use water, it's not bad. That'll probably grow more than everything, anything else anyways. This one was watered too, so that's good. Okay, well, that's what we got going on. That's what we got going on. That's insane, bro. That's been on for like an hour. Let's go to the backyard. One hour in a little section. No way, maybe if it was dry as all hell, sure. So yesterday I emptied the bucket of fish stuff. I mean, we're talking crazy microbes, crazy nutrients. That water was filled with just poop, fish poop. Here's all my expensive ass wood that I haven't, I'm not gonna put in there because it releases too many tannins. I put the cores from yesterday in here and as well as here, just to get some more, you know, dirt and stuff. Greens is kind of growing. I'm not gonna say it's fully growing, kind of growing. You know, it takes forever to establish. Once I see this, the seeds are gone, because the seeds are still here, then I'll hit it up real quick. I just don't want to spread too much stuff around everything. Oh yeah, I put a ton of fish shit back here. Bro, that's wild. Be very cautious when you do beehive because like I said, I put that on one hour. It is soaked to all hell. That's such a waste. <laughs> that is such a waste of water. Well, should we bust out Troy? I think Troy wants to eat a little bit and then we can furt and water the back back. Bust out some Troy real quick. Huh, huh Troy, you ready to play? Let's do it, dude.
value. Guys, the camera overheated. I have to let it chill for a second. I'm on my old phone. I lost my microphone. You're gonna laugh where it was, where I found it. <laughs> Why? I was in the shed and this thing is a magnet, right? See, there's a little magnet there. And it's always on my freaking hat like this. But this magnet swiped it off after. <laughs> so there's no audio for like 10, 15 minutes of the video. I'm so dead right now, dude. I'm so dead. I think I can go ahead and drill it real quick just to get, get it in there. Cause I'm sick of them little uh, snow tracks. <laughs> I'm gonna let the front chill for a second. We'll just do this drill. Well, we'll test it out probably. We got plenty of time. It's really hot, I'm just relaxing. I just wanna say thank you guys so much. Uh, the support is just insane. Like yesterday's video is blowing up. It's not stopping, it's amazing. You guys are awesome. It's the best video we've had so far this season. This new video with the edging, awesome video as well. And then I have the video that we just did that I haven't edited yet. You guys will probably see that one. You're, you'll see that one for sure already. Um, that one's exciting. That one, that's really exciting. I did a light overseed, which is hilarious. Just aeration overseed and, you know, seeing if it'll just plump up just a little bit before we actually overseed. Stupid. Pre-overseed before the overseed. But anywho, I'm gonna let the camera cool down because it's, it's hot. It's so hot. I haven't seen that. I, I only see that in the summer. So it's definitely too hot to have the camera out. I might need to bust out the umbrella, but it's all good, baby. Let's get to it. I'm gonna chill for a second, like I said, and we're back. See you in a second. But every time I backed up, you know, this house was right there, you know. Oh, yeah. No, it was nice, Rick. It was nice. Don't even. <laughs> I'm just saying, but I like to get it tighter. You know what I'm saying? But I got it tight now. I, that pair, you said parallax, right? Yeah, the, the, the swing with that, with the other drone with the, with the, with the four. With mm -hmm. the, excuse me, the Mavic 3 Pro. That would look awesome with the, like I said, with the telephoto. Yep. And the background, like, swinging real fast, you know. Does that also do vertical? No, you have to crop that. Oh, you have to crop that. Wow. It was insane. I was looking at it yesterday. I was like, oh my gosh. It's like so many pixels in 9x16. It's insane. Because you're actually seeing it cropped as you're filming yeah. it, you can actually zoom in on your subject better because you don't have the full range. You only have that little on the screen. You have that same exactly. to work with. So you can actually really zoom in and get it nice. Okay, my dudes. Man, Rick's too good to us. He's getting more drone shots right now. And he's making it long so we can film for some shorts he's the man like i said all we're gonna do is drill into here that way the wheels will spin without these so i don't know how i'm gonna get to that one but we'll figure it out we're just gonna drill through here i think i have drywall screws we got a little 112 playing in the ears right now you know how we do we're 90s kids this is just a shield for the chain Usually also how you you take this off to back lap. Piscar, stay sharp. Look at that right there. Still looks good. Realistically, if you would just put a platform right here and a motor with another chain, it would spin this. Hmm, that has the potential to be an electric reel for sure. This can go all the way through Oh, you know what? It needs to be really, really long. Let's see if we can't get this going through. Uh-oh. Careful. <laughs> careful careful chief you might have found a solution look at that it's stuck together let's get another one in there just to have another one in there opposite side just to really really be in there Is it time to cut off the chains? Okay, you guys are probably confused. So these outer wheels 
drive the actual mower itself. If you're new here, this is a Fiskar Stay Sharp and it just comes with two wheels in the back. We added these middle wheels from Harbor Freight and what I'm doing is I'm screwing the two outer wheels together to the Harbor Freight wheels. That way it drives it because the outer wheels don't touch the ground. Yeah, if you're doing this, just screw the outer wheels together. Now, I can't take full credit on this. Someone told me to do this. Uh, shout out to you. I forgot who it was, but shout out to you for uh, telling me to do this. This is actually really genius. Initially, I glued these in. <laughs> what the hell are we doing, dude? I mean, it glued, it stayed glued. Okay, moment of truth. if I adjust it, I'm just gonna make sure it reaches that corner because I noticed it doesn't reach it. This is reaching as well. A little bit more. Heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Rick were chopping it up about drones. My damn phone's dead. I wanna freaking shoot this drone for you guys real quick. Hella bad. Well, anyways, this is working phenomenal. And it is smooth. Look at that. We don't have to. Come on, bro. This might be a go-to this season. You know, I might put the a front roller on. I might just to, if I start using it in the front, which I probably won't, because we have so many damn mowers for the front, but you know how it is. <laughs> 
Okay, I'm gonna let my phone charge, then I'll put the drone in the air for you guys. Thanks for watching this episode, you guys are the best. We will get to it here tomorrow. Me and Rick were chopping it up last night about drones, so I got I cut off the, the video early, so I started droning. We still have to fertilize. It's gonna be good. Always fun chopping it up with Rick about drones. He, he knows so much information. I, my next drone is definitely gonna be filmed this way, nine by 16, because that footage is too crisp. It's a little too crispy. Let's go ahead and get our fertilizer. Please tell me this is triple 16. Yes. What do they recommend again? Always read the label. Six pounds per thousand. Spreader. Six pounds per thousand. It's exactly a thousand square feet back there. So when I was starting off, I never measured my stuff out, ever. You should definitely measure your stuff out. Just so you're not wasting product. This is all purpose, triple 16 from Wilco. Six pounds. Six pounds will do us good. Look at those prills. Oops. <laughs> Easy peasy. Got some insecticide just to. I saw a bunch of wasps back there. Mix it up good. Granular cocktail is a good thing too. See, my hips feeling a little better, but I started squatting, and you can tell. We gotta stop. <laughs> After this, we'll turn on the side. We'll turn on the side and we'll water it in. No mowing today. I'm gonna save that. You guys saw the freaking Fiskars is doing work. I think I am gonna keep him front roller free because he got a rear roller like no one's business. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So nice today. 71 right now. Feeling good. Triple 16, we'll do a level six. Spread it all out evenly. Oh yeah, look at that. Put some back here in the backyard because it's not growing as, as good. You got me? You following? Just a little bit, just to test it out. I'm pretty sure it's because it needs water. It also needs an aeration. We need to aerate. That can wait. I always just be sweating like instantly. That was the thing when I was playing basketball, my basketball career. I uh, I was hella sweaty. I was like drenched. I had to wear a freaking headband. Look at how messy that is, ugh. Another project I gotta clean up. Definitely gonna cover it up. I gotta get my baskets from Ikea. Still gotta go to Ikea. It's just in, it's so far. I hate going there. <laughs> my ex used to just love going to Ikea. I was like, why the fuck do we have to go to Ikea? We have everything already. We don't need no damn Ikea shit. Zone two, just to get a little bit wet. Yes, look at that dual action. We got two sprinkler heads. It's all about the water, guys. If you don't have water, nothing's gonna grow. A lot of people say, don't water so much. 
You're tripping. You need a water. A lot of you guys are asking. The AI is still in the garage. I just don't know if I have the balls to mess up the front lawn. I could possibly do a makeshift back here just so we're not wasting so much water because I bought the extra stuff for that as well. I bought the extra mounts so we can put them in the corners. They can do their AI thing. There is one head that it's, it's, it's really irritating me. It's this number four head here. It just doesn't want to cooperate. Okay, that should be good enough. Let's test this one out, see how far. Sometimes these, these are just the days, you know, just like dialing things down, making sure everything works again. I'm sure guys with in, in ground have to do the same thing. You know, my buddies up in Lake Stevens, we had to adjust that crap. See, that, one's, that one works really nice. That's a nice situation. Oh, oh yes. Yes, sir, hitting, hitting really good. That's what it's all about. You gotta have that nice coverage for your lawn. It's all about the water, you know? Here's a little chicken. Here's a little chicken. He likes the, the expensive seed. Look at that little chicken. <laughs> One of you guys said the low flying cobra chickens. I was dead. I choked on the teriyaki, bro. That teriyaki went down the wrong hole. Here's his comments are so funny. Okay. I keep saying okay. 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 <laughs> Feels so good to put down some triple 16 in the backpack. Keep on doing what we do. That's all I needed to do today was triple 16 and water that sucker in. Oh, you know what? I can't turn on yet. I have to adjust the rear sprinkler because it's just like staying stagnant. Remember, we upgraded these faucets for a million dollars last season. That was ridiculous. Okay, you guys, the new guys, the, new, the noobs here. Should you be watering at night? No, you gotta give it time to dry up. Your last water time should be, well, depending too, if you're in this, the shade and stuff like that, you should be only watering in the morning, realistically. You don't need to be watering in the sun until summer. We call that lawn syringing. This is easy. This is just a little orbit. Okay, she's flowing. Like the salmon of Capistrano. See, that one's not even on. Really? That one's not even on, bro. You gotta play this game, this uh, sprinkler roulette game. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get soaked. Oh, shit, 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 oh shit. You got some water up my shorts? <laughs> This is an issue right here. This guy right here won't turn off. The coverage is fantastic. I mean, it it is on point. I love these little orbits heads. I'll tell you right now that Fiskars might be in the front. I think I'm just gonna real mow the entire season because it's a you can tell it's a lot more even. It's a lot more sharp. It looks crazy good. Fiskars is a good reel mower. If you're, if you're starting off, do that. Do, do the little conversion that we did. You can always add a front roller if you want. It's just a 15 inch front roller. You have to make your own brackets. This is what it's all about. This is how you get ahead in the summer. See, so what we did was we were working on in the winter for spring. Now we're working in spring for the summer. You're always a, you're always a season ahead. You have to be ahead. So now's the time to put down some granular hydrotain. Now's the time to put down a couple wetting agents. So the, that automatically turned off. Now check this out. This one does not want to turn off. Watch, it's going to turn off now. You dirty bastard. <laughs> Yesterday I was running for an hour. Okay, let's get it. <laughs> Don't worry, the bed will be fixed soon. I'm going to like black mulch this season just to test her out a little bit. 
Come on, front yard action. What's going on here? I'm right, right next to you. Oh. oh, such a, such a nice sight. You know, it's game time when you turn the sprinklers on. When it's golden hour and the freaking water's on. Just look at that little, wah, little sunlight, little waters. Oh yeah. Sheesh. Look at all that mist. Yeah. Grow, you little seedlings. Oh, grow. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, this is the grass of all grasses. The cool thing about the seed that we get is there's zero weed seeds. Zero weed seeds. That's what I like about blackout. It's zero weed seeds. We don't want to mess with that. that that's what brings in the poa annuas, the, the, the poa trivs. Don't mess with that, guys. And you see how dark it is. The nice thing about having a dark grass is you don't need to be putting down a ton of iron every single freaking week. You don't need it. It's already a dark cultivar. You're already shades darker than when someone has a regular seed and applies iron. You're ahead of the game. But of course, we want it black. This is very resilient grass, hat trick firewall, very disease resistant, but at the same time, you don't want to risk it. So, don't water at night. <laughs> I'm gonna get a neti pot today, and then I have been doing a teaspoon of honey. Hopefully that'll help. You know, this, this the neighbor patches, they just don't really need water. <laughs> I mean, they are getting the most sun, and they it's thriving. I mean, it's growing like crazy. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. This one's still dying. Yeah, you can tell it's dying. This is fun, just chilling. Just chilling with you guys. Going over what we're doing. Getting the water on. Guys, black mulch, don't worry, it's coming. People are saying trim your bushes. Well, no. Those are azaleas. I don't trim those. I let those do, it, do do their thing. Then you get more pink. I'm gonna pull all the weeds and stuff. That's that takes ten minutes. That's that's not a big deal. I'm not focused on that right now. <laughs> well, my dudes, you have. Pretty much two episodes in this one too. We have the Fiskars fix. We got a couple of Mo sessions. We got some fertilizer in the backpack. We got some insecticide in the backpack. I saw a bunch of hornets back there, not bees. I don't mind bees. Bees are fine. It's them hornets. It's them uh, wasps. We don't want those. They, they don't do anything for us. <laughs> the bees help us though. We want the bees. This, I have no doubt, we're gonna have full coverage for the summer again. Prep your mind for summer right now. Spring is tomorrow. First day of spring's tomorrow. Prep your head for the summer game. Sorry to you, sorry to you guys that are still like cold. I know, I, I it's it's bad. But Pacific Northwest guys, guys, prep for summer. Get your hydrotane now. Get your wetting agents. Get your granular hydrotane, your liquid hydrotane, your sea kelp, your humic. You need to get your summer weed stuff, and you'll be on your way. I know a lot of you guys are saying you, you're purchasing this hat trick and fireball. Good job. You, you, you want this grass, it's, it's phenomenal grass. Look at this little chicken just up our ass. Little, chicken little. I just wanna call this little shit, chicken little. I'll see you guys tomorrow. You guys are the best. Shout out to my winter crew, preseason winter crew. You guys, we had over, almost three million views over winter. Amazing, killing the game. You guys are the best. We'll catch you in the next video. Take it easy.